Hello everyone, it's DA here. Hope you guys are doing great. Hope you are doing amazing. Today I want to talk about mental health and gaming. I know this is not a usual video that you will see on this channel, but something just put it in my heart this morning that I had to share it with you guys. And while a lot of us may not think this is important, I have been studying the shifts in the domino patterns of outrage that flows around. Some content creators are struggling with it, and when they give out that energy as well, a lot of us tap onto it and it affects us and it creates this wave of outrage. The rest of us gamers are also dealing with a similar issue and just soaking up all that energy. What qualifies me to speak on this issue? Well, I'm not a professional. It's all because I care. And like I said, something just put it in my mind this morning. And this is also coming from a research that I assisted a fellow colleague in. I completed my own personal research on Alzheimer's not too long ago. And I also touched on how gaming can help keep the minds active, even at a very old age. But after that, the next case was the psychological state of the gaming industry. It's not about gaming leading to violence or any of those. We're talking about the underlying roots of gamers outrage outside of what a developer or a publisher does. We obviously noted that gaming for most people is a gateway from this real world, a place where people feel powerful, free and without problems. A place where you leave all your burdens, anxieties, tears, and sorrows behind. A place for you to build new relationships and in some cases, start life afresh, away from all the trials and tribulations. So when there is a predatory or evil practice in the gaming industry, it hurts us gamers. It's something that affects our personal lives our strong desire to take in game seriously, it's not just about how much time or money we spent in it, but because there are other things that happened in our lives that makes us consider the gaming community as our real family, every single attack towards it, predatory or not, is considered as a personal attack. The fact that some of our siblings were really bad to us and threatening us when we were kids, this is one of them. Some of our parents never really cared about us. Some of us can't even remember the last time someone told us that they loved us or the last time when someone hugged us. Or in some cases, we can't even remember the last time someone had a positive conversation with us or showed us that they care. And the most of us, we can't even remember the last time someone gave us positive reinforcements or tell us it's going to be okay. In fact, it is not something that is dealing with just gamers. However, because my community is mostly gamers, that is why I'm tackling it on this side. The constant comments just to get a response is one of these things that we see. You have the drive to get satisfaction from a negative comment or for someone to acknowledge your existence. It's all part of that psychological feeling. People are dealing with depression, anxiety, different things, or some cases, some people are dealing with thoughts of suicide. There are people you can talk to. So there are different things or different tools out there from individuals who can help. All these problems, as I've examined, stem from sources outside of gaming. And we all need that professional help, that guidance, or at least someone to talk to. Go outside sometimes, put on a smile, talk to people, release all that anger by going into a boxing ring or something you know, go jogging because some of these things are healthy and could be helpful to you. Release some of those hormones and toxins in your body. Drink water. You know, that will be a really great way to start off your day because at the end of everything, I know that regardless of where we stand on our gaming ideologies or philosophies, we are still brothers and sisters under the sun. And I want to let you guys know today, I love every one of you. Yes, I love every single one of you. If you're watching this video, I love you. And I don't know why, but something just put it in my heart to share with you guys today. I know it's crazy. This is not the usual video you see on this channel, but um, I just had to share it. I've been working on that research and I also saw how it is affecting the gaming community and everything that people say in some ways or some shape or form is how they get off that anger 
or deal with the problems that they're having inside. So I will leave some links below in the comment section. This video is not sponsored in any shape or form. No sponsors, nothing. But I will leave a link in the description below for some of you who might need the help. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.